Hey guys, it's your boy, Brad Brad here, bringing you another awesome video! Hey guys, it's your boy, Brad Brad here, the number one goat hater. Today we're doing something a bit different, actually, boys. Today we're going to be doing a live commentary of a game. And we're going to be playing the usual, The Hungry Man, one of my favorite decks. So without further ado, let's just get on with it, boys. We'll get a start here, make sure I got the right deck. Whoops, it easies. I'm still on this, apparently. Well, yeah, we'll see my changes. Apparently I didn't make changes on it. That's my default deck. Let's put her on. Where is the Hungry Man deck at? Hungry Man, Hungry Man. There you are. This is it here, boys. This deck will be running here. The usual, my, one of my favorite decks to run. I made that bit changes since the last deck profile. Maybe we'll do an updated deck profile, actually. But uh, before that, let's get on with the duels, eh, boys? All right, let's start this stuff, then. Let's see if we can find someone now, and then we'll be right back. All right, guys, we found someone. We found Smoky Dragoon, rank 147 out of 154. We're going to go with the scissors. I knew I should have went with paper. And good luck, have fun. Let's get this duel on the go, duelist. And we presume we'll be going second, yep. No problem. That's not bad going second hand, I suppose. Could be worse. The mine con's always good to get there. I don't know, he's thumbs up being born in the standby base. Anyways, yep. Yeah. Oh, yes, lovely. How did I know that would happen? As long as he doesn't hit my cyber drive, we're okay. Alright, tribe's going. Uh, what else do I want to get rid of here? Uh, the heavy slump might be good. The mine con. Oh, we'll get rid of mine con. He's probably going to set something now that he's seen that. Alright, cool. Stand by main. Nothing. Cool. Alright, let's start off here. Let's go over the classic play, shall we? We'll go over the cold wave. Thumbs up, see if it's okay. Alright, cold way, set jar, and pan, go. Let's see if it will resolve, boys. Alright, alright, I see you, I see you. Stand by main. We're going to flip some of my cyber jar. Effect going through? Oh yeah. Take that, sucker. Alright, let's banish five here. Wow, five horrible ones. Looks like he's on some sort of, uh, what do you call it, deck, um, Horus deck by the looks of it with the some chaos stuff inside of it. Cool. Got a dust shoot. I want to see if we can play around that or not. And some virus quite annoying. Yeah. Let's see here. I think now it's got one, two, three, four, five, six. Got six in hand. Hmm, what do I have in my graveyard? I got a tribe in there, eh? Okay, I got. Ah, uh, fuck, we gotta get rid of that though. It's the only problem, eh? Fuck it. Let's go for the giant true nade. Let's see if we can get that heavy slump to go off. Okay. Eh, could be worse, I guess. Oh, there's my exchange. That's what I needed. Oh, well. All right, so we're going to do the Thundras. Do that. Now, I could... I could revive my... What do you call it there? And take out his Zumbira. Hmm... I could, I could attack into that. Yes, I have an idea here. Uh, let's see here. We're gonna we're gonna pretty much burial. We will grab the tribe. I should have did this differently, but that's okay. We'll attack in, take 200. And 
main phase two. We will declare the effect. And we will kill both of his monsters. And that's probably where his other spy was anyways. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll then set my slump. We haven't normal summoned yet. Now I think about it. So we will set the Gaia. Set judgment just in case. And pass it on over. Standby phase. We're going to declare heavy slump then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Let's see. Watch. Let's watch your claim uh, turn player priority. Ready? All right. Cool. Wonder if he knows that slump still goes off even if you do chain to it. There we go. Yeah, he does. All right. Let's see if we got anything. Got a set and a set. Okay. Shouldn't be a spy, so we shouldn't have to worry about that. We'll cold wave just to be sure. See if this goes through. Alrighty then. That's fine with me. I will get rid of my sayings. I only got a couple more targets left. We'll bring out him. Attack him with Butcher. Serpent. That's fine with me. 16 and 17. Oh yeah, that's game, boys. All right, let's side out here. Usually we're gonna get rid of this here. We'll put in the mind constants. We are going second. We'll do the berserk gorilla since we're going second. Thinking now, do I want to get rid of my heavy slump combo? Let's do that because he knows I'm on it. So we're gonna get rid of that there. He's playing scapegoats, so we'll do that. I think we'll put in the brain. Combo. No, we'll put in duo because we're not playing the heavy slump anymore. Uh, I don't really want judgment or exchange going second either. Is the thing. So we'll get rid of my. We'll put it in the Borg and Brain Con. I think I didn't think I see any warriors out of them. I'm gonna see if we find us. We'll put also put Mystic Swordsman in there. He's got a pretty big amount of flips. Alright. That's not a bad hand. Ready for it to get dueled? Wow, no duel. It's a first. All right, ready? Here comes the, uh, no, no dust shoot either. Wow. It's a miracle. All right, let's see if this will go through. Wow. I love when people negate that when it's your first card. Uh, let's see here. We want to keep the, uh, want to keep the Mystic Swordsman, obviously. I'm thinking Gaia's got to go. What else do I want to get rid of here? I had to get rid of Reflect Bounder. We're not going to True Nade yet. This is probably a Spire to Koichi, so we're going to find out with our Gorilla. <laughs> get in there, my monkey man. Alright. And that's all I got. That's fine with me. I don't have anything. Hmm. I'm thinking we're going to cold wave first. Yeah, let's cold wave. Alright. Cold wave goes through. So we're going to bring out you. We are going to get rid of a true nade. And get rid of those. I wonder if he knows that uh, 
Because his name's not a warrior. Do I want to get rid of my other true nade? Uh, I'm thinking I'll get rid of my mystic swordsman or not, and I'll deal with this stupid thing. The bard be so annoying sometimes. I only have a light in my graveyard. I've got no darks in there, unfortunately. If only I had a dark, I'm gonna probably gonna gain actually. Uh, let's see here. I'm thinking now if I want to get rid of my swordsman or not. Hmm. It's a lot of advantage we're losing, but YOLO! Fuck it. And we're 16. Uh. Alright, go on. We've got a true nade left in hand. I don't know if that was the right choice or not, but we'll find out. I mean, if I get a dark and I pitch it, I might be able to just win like that, so we'll see. Nice. Alright, hit in for 16. And a Sakurat's in armor, that's fine with me. Set so, card and pass. Ooh, a Reaper. We're going to kill that. And then that live. Just think if he wants to set anything else now. Got nothing. Okay. Oh, lovely. I'm going to pass, I guess. Drawn crap. Nice if I get dark in the grave, but, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah. What are you thumbs up for? I got nothing, buddy. Okay, then. I, I love when people do this. Like, what are you thinking? All it takes is for me to get a gorilla to hit in and get some serious damage. Plus, now I can do this without any fear of hitting it. And we're just going to swiggle our mouse and hit this one. Guys, pro tip. Never, ever... Ever normal summon Sinister Serpent and attack directly with it. That is one of the stupidest things you can do. Generally one of the stupidest things. Because if I can get BLS on the field, that's probably game. That's 27, that's 5700 attack. If I can get a dark in the grave. Ooh. Oh no. Go right ahead. I'm not going to set a monster now, so... We'll take the damage. Ay yay yay. Activate cold wave and that's all I got. I can't draw anything to save my life. And I'll lose the guy in normal summon servant. <laughs> Unbelievable. My oh my. What a game that was, eh? Alright. We'll put the exchange back in, boys. Uh, should we put the jar robber back in? Yeah! Fuck it. He's on Horus, so I don't really want to keep a guy in there, to be honest. Uh, I'll put Magic Cylinder back as well. I'm thinking, uh, let's see what I'm going to get rid of here. Get rid of my Dekoichi. Magic Cylinder. Alright, see if we get a good hand here or not. Uh, uh, let's see. Not a good exchange hand, that's for sure. That's a really bad exchange hand, actually. Just normal summon. Reflect Bounder and pass. I got nothing else. He's welcome to attack into it if he wants to. Is that a monster? Any back row? No back row. Beauty. That's what we like to see, baby. That's what we like to see. Alright, bring out our Mystic Swordsman. Wacha! No fear. Oh, just a singing. Okay. Yeah, no big deal. Go ahead. Everyone knows what singing does. Cool. Hit in for 17. I can be an idiot and take his, uh, his Suki on me. <laughs> With exchange, and that would be funny. Uh, not worth it though, unfortunately. No, nope, my hand is be too good for him to pick from with exchange. So, 
Probably just gonna normal summon Tsukiyomi take out the Bounder. No? Okay then. Oh no! He's going for the King Dragoon! I'm shaking. I mean, if he's got horse level 6, I'm fucked. Beauty. So we like to see. Uh, 900. So that's uh, 1300. We're going to set the Kaiku, I suppose. Just to get it dark in the grave, hopefully. I know we can't target him, but if we get BLS, then we'll be good. Let's hope the guy can't get level 6. I'm a little bit scared of that now. Of course. Isn't that lovely? Pick the 17. Chaos yeah, Sorks Live, which, I mean, okay. Lovely. That's great news. Ay, ay, ay. I don't think we do over here, why not? I'll hit the middle card. Nice, hit Serpent, lovely. We gotta get rid of that friggin' what do you call it there? Get rid of that reflect bounder, I don't wanna have too many cards. You know, I should have put that in attack now I think about it. Damn. Oh well, that just doesn't matter. Oh, I did that wrong. Yeah, I did do that wrong. Fuck. You didn't realize that. I took a Tsukiyomi. Well, I probably lose here. It's lovely. Can't draw to save my life. No, I do lose actually. Lovely. Well, that's it, guys. That was a shit game. What are you gonna do though? Sometimes it happens. I mean, it's cool for me. What do you expect, right? What? No skill involved there, eh? Hey. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm gonna go now. I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed the video. That was the replay. That was a shitty game, but eh, what are you gonna do? We'll get a good replay next time. But I'm going to bed. So peace out, guys. Bread, bread, signing out.